I love how this does this. I don't know if you see it on your end, but the second I touch this tri this little setup that's on, I guess you could call it a tripod, it clips onto um, a shelf, like a shelf, and in my case, it's clipped onto my bathroom, my mirror shelf. And when I hit hit it ever so slightly, it just kind of gives it this, and I'm like, oh, not again. Anyway, good morning. How are you? It is Wednesday. Um, I can move it up just a smidge. I don't know what happens. I don't change my, I don't get taller or shorter, but for whatever reason, and it's going to bounce for a little bit, but for whatever reason, yeah. So, um, we're going to do some makeup. Are you ready? Um, why am I putting on makeup today? <laughs> why not? <laughs> We've done all the skincare and all that fun stuff we're going to go in with. The Peter Thomas Roth. Y'all know I can't see this. I don't know why I try. I am excited. I'm going to tell you. I am going to order. Not. It's probably going to be a few weeks. I'm going to order the... I, the I think I said tart before, but it's Urban Decay Face Bond um, that Miss Vicky talked about. Man, she's she's been wearing it for a month, and she said that it has held up really well. Um, so I'm gonna go with her recommendation. I will link her channel down below. Um, I don't know what I'm doing that for. Probably because I get less. Um, We'll link her down below. I enjoy her content. She kind of seems to be a lot like me, and that's a good thing. In a in a she I'll, the good things. <laughs> we'll put it that way. She doesn't seem to be as much of a hot mess as I am, but yeah. Um, I do like this primer quite well, I'm going to tell you, and I apologize. Apparently, they apparently the pollen count um, was high yesterday, and we took a little, I don't have a dog today. Well for a, a few hours. Um, he is gone to doggy daycare to make some friends, get some socialization and a little bit more, um, yeah, get a little bit more confidence in himself. Much needed. What we're gonna do is go into, do I wanna do, let me look. Wait, 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 wait. That's the golden palette. That's a bit much for I think I've had this shirt on for a video. I'm not sure. This is this shirt reminds me of my mother and my aunts. Um, and kind of makes me feel all special. We're gonna go into the big ego palette. What um are we? No. Let's. Yes. We're going to. Sorry. Can't make up my mind. It, you hear Sargy around my feet. Um, he does not come downstairs. So when I'm up here, we kind of have to make up for the, the days, the part, the. He's used to sleeping with me. And for whatever reason. He won't sleep, come downstairs to sleep with me. So, um, I know that sounds so crazy, but you know what? It is what it is. Um, we probably ought to put some primer on my e-balls. What you think? Guys, uh, I about forgot how to do this. The other thing that's going to happen today, I've got to go through this mirror 
or this cabinet that's behind this mirror. Having strength in my hands would be a nice thing. And get rid of stuff that needs gotten rid of because there's a bunch. I'm using a Sigma eyeshadow base. Don't know exactly why I'm using so much of it, but I am. And we're going to ignite. I should know that because it's like, I think I have maybe three of them. And I have not forgotten, guys. I, I know that I have a bunch of stuff to try on. I have not forgotten. Um, hopefully, two things are going to happen while on the days that Mayor is in daycare. I will have time to go and focus on makeup and not have to be interrupted, for lack of a better word, to let him out. Because when that happens with my little ADHD brain, there's a good chance that I'm not going to come back to what I'm doing because I get distracted and start doing something else. And then I end up with a whole bunch of stuff that's half done. And so that's kind of part of another perk of... Um, him going to daycare for a day or a few hours, whatever. It will allow me to get more stuff done. Yeah. It also, um, we have our reunion coming up this weekend. So, um, I'm going to go start in this corner. Let me show you how pretty that is. And uh, y'all know I have a weakness for Tarte eyeshadows. Tarte, Natasha Denona. Uh, I can't remember. There's another brand that won't come to my brain. It used to be ColourPop. I used to, I, I'm thankfully not as hooked on ColourPop as I used to be because I have scaled back my makeup collection a lot. Um, most of my big palettes that I had that were Morphe palettes are gone. I passed them on. I have three new palettes um, that I hauled a long time ago that we haven't played in yet. We'll get there. Um, we'll play in one and see how I like it and we may pass them along. I don't know. Anyway, um, but what I was saying with Mayor being in daycare, I can focus on, you know, sifting through on days when my husband's not home or not working on a vehicle or what have you, I can focus on the task at hand to keep get, keep the momentum that we have started going again on just getting stuff gone through and gotten rid of. Yay, I'm happy. Um, it's been a slow process and it's starting to get momentum. And it's starting to make me extremely happy. And I'm talking and I need to pick a color. Um, let's go let's see. Let's go right there. Now, friends of mine or people that I follow or try to hop in and support, whatever. Um, if y'all have a late stream, and by late now, that means generally mm, 9 o'clock. Um, our day starts at 4. Not always, but... For me, sometimes like this morning, I may get to go back to sleep um, for a little bit. But for the most part, 4, 4.30 is when our day starts. 
And so that means if you're having a late stream, um, and my apologies to Shannon because this happened the other night. I was really excited to listen to the stream that she was doing. Um, I can, I can, you know, I can deal with something that is not drama. I'll put it that way. And that will hold my attention. Okay. Um, that's not coming out right at all. Topic. You know, there that was, you know, if it's like a cold case or something like that or history related or something like that, it will hold my attention better. Okay. Um, I want desperately to use a color that really will not work with what I have on. So we're going to go right over here. And But anyway, um, if you're having strings that hit about 9 o'clock my time, you may see me for a few minutes, and I may still look like I'm there, but I can promise you nine times out of ten I'm asleep. Uh, falling asleep in these dreams now. Um, and I will tell you too. I fall asleep listening and watching one thing and I wake up and it's something completely different. And it's like, what? <laughs> and, that it it cracks me up because I'm it happens to my husband because he will turn on like music or something like that and watch it to go to sleep and we wake up to whatever and it's like who oh. you know and, well, that was not what we went to bed with go ahead this is one of the lithe brushes that came in one of my boxy charms. I'm not happy with boxy charm. Just take that. And just kind of back it on the lid. Yeah, I like that. It's a little darker than what I wanted for today, but I'm liking that color. Yeah. Get a I'm trying to keep my face as still as possible, especially my forehead, because the, you know, de-wrinkling is happening. That tore a mistake, but we'll fix it. Uh, I can't tell you how good it feels to put on makeup whenever I get up here and get to just do and take some of this pink. I'm pretty. And we're just gonna go like that. Kind of soften that look up a little bit. Kind of open my eyes back up. And 
that's pretty much where we're going to land with that for now. Hold on. Okay. We are going to use the Maracuja Juicy Glow, and I will probably put a foundation on top of it. And you just kind of prime this, I guess, for lack of a better way of putting it. I don't see product coming up here. Fine glasses, they're usually close. Just so we can make sure we know what we're doing. Oh, there's some. Oh, that's pretty cool. It comes up on the bottom. Yes, I need to get to the eye doctor. I have an appointment. Hopefully, I will stay well. Ooh, I like this color. I'm not so sure how I feel about the application part of this. I will tell you that. But I like this color. Okay, we're going to tell you, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not fond of the application. Eh, that kind of smooshed at the wrong time. That is a bronze. And the reason why... It's going on and then I'm going to go in with a little bit of foundation is because we could do this this is how it is let me get the excess off of here I'm not sure how I feel about that um, that's just gonna have to be something that I have to deal with but what this is going to do and I forgot to put on sunscreen but oh well what this is going to do, we're going to take my trusty double wear. And what should happen, got to shake this up. It's been a long time since I've used this. I'm going to put it on the back of my hand so later on y'all can laugh at me because I will get somewhere. Like picking up my dog <laughs> and forget that I have makeup on the back of my hand. Yes, it will happen. I'm take a Sigma Black Kabuki brush. Tap it in here. Start working on the center of my face. Pull that out. Might not work exactly how I have it planned because this is a full coverage foundation that I grabbed. Um, the purpose of the tart going under was to kind of add a little bit of radiance, add a little bit of glow. face helps to turn it back on right and go in with just a touch of blush using the cream blush in coral dawn from sigma i'm only going to use one today And since this is a full coverage foundation, I'm going to go back and add just a touch more of the tart. Uh, 
I really am not a fan of how this dispenses. I'm just going to tell you. The feel of the product is nice. It just kind of... Doesn't roll as... The roll part is what's bugging me. We're just going to kind of buff that in on top because I forgot that... Full coverage is going to cover up anything that I put under it. And that just puts a little glow back. Kind of makes the crinkles look less crinklier. <laughs> I hope you're having a really good day. I really, really do. Um, give me a sec. Went ahead and did my brows because you've seen me do them for about nine years now or so. <laughs> um, same product, the benefit, give me brow. That's it. Gonna test out. It's gonna kind of jump to the front because I've been waiting to use this. Um, we'll do one eye. I'll do the other one off camera because it's getting a little lengthy. Um, the tartlet. Cubing Mascara. It has like a rubber wand that is similar to, I want to say, it's similar to the Last Freak. Um, I'm gonna have to fool with my eyeshadow a little bit more because needs to blend out a little bit better. So far, comparing this to my Estee Lauder, it's a no. But, hold on. Okay, I've kind of fiddled with it. And I put about maybe two coats. Um, I don't know, I have to think about this and see how it wears. As it stands, I'm not a fan. Um, it seems to be, the formula seems to be a little sticky, if that makes sense. Um, we'll give it a second try. We'll see. Um, We'll probably do tomorrow's video. Uh, while Ian has gone for his piano lessons, unless they get canceled. Last week they were canceled because his teacher had an uh, emergency. Um, we have his belt test tonight. We have church tonight. Um, we have Kingdom Sound this weekend. Um, we won't be here. So, um, I'm excited for for my church, so it's going to be good. Um, trying to think of what else I was going to say. Um, the palette's a yes. This is a yes. over top of the Estee Lauder with the Peter Thomas Roth foundation or primer. That's a yes so far. I'll 
check back in and let you know final what I think about it later on today because I'm going to wear it all day. <laughs>